Stories and content in Weird Darkness can be disturbing for some listeners and is intended for mature audiences only. Parental discretion is strongly advised. I'm Darren Marlar, and this is a Weird Darkness Bonus Bite. From the New York Post, Man Killed Roommate and Lived with Body in Closet for Months by Catherine Donleby. A Las Vegas sex offender killed his roommate and lived with her decomposing body inside a barricaded closet for two months out of fear that she would come back from the dead. George Anthony Bone was arrested Wednesday and charged with murder after the woman's family found her corpse inside the shared home, according to the Las Vegas Metropolitan Police Department. The victim was identified as Beverly Ma, Bone's longtime friend from high school who moved in with Bone last summer. The accused killer allegedly told cops he knew that Ma had been dead for a while and that she had committed suicide, according to court documents. Investigators were called to the grisly scene after Ma's family had visited the home earlier in the day to hash out the cause of an unusually high air conditioning bill. Bone allegedly told the female family member that Ma was dead and gone and had been in the closet for two months before offering to show her the body. She noticed a cooler against the bedroom closet door, and the bottom of the door had a towel which covered the gap. George told her that she can open it and see. Though the cause of Ma's death is still under investigation, police determined she was a victim of a homicide and suspect that she was strangled. Investigators also believe she was killed on May 4th, the same day she made a frantic 911 call in which a man and a woman could be heard screaming at one another with the call ending with a woman's voice saying, why? When police responded that day and knocked on the door, no one answered. When asked why he didn't call for help, Bone's response was, I was afraid of going back to jail for being found with a dead body. Bone instead continued living in the house with Ma's decomposing body and allegedly took advantage of his dead roommate's finances. He's accused of ordering more than 170 items that were charged to Ma Bone's Amazon account and using her phone to text someone that she could not attend a July 4th party because she, quote, wanted to be sober, not travel, and not be around people, unquote. He also set the air conditioning to 60 degrees because he thought it would limit the number of flies that were in the house. That was me being simultaneously superstitious and, um, just distraught, Bone said in a statement, just watching too many horror movies and ghost stories growing up. Bone is a level 3 registered sex offender in Nevada after accepting a no-contest plea in 2013 to attempting lewdness with a child under 14. He was sentenced to two to eight years in state prison. He was initially arrested before for allegedly sexually assaulting a girl two years earlier when she was 11. Find the link to the original story in the show notes, and find more news in the Weird News and blog at WeirdDarkness.com. Hey Weirdos! Be sure to click the like button and subscribe to this channel, and click the notification bell so you don't miss future videos. I post videos seven days a week. And while you're at it, spread the darkness by sharing this video with someone you know who loves all things strange and macabre. If you want to listen to the podcast, you can find it at WeirdDarkness.com slash listen.